Now we're going to make a neutral caramel twill. We can call this the 111 neutral caramel twill. Why is it called neutral caramel? Because it uses one part isomalt, one part glucose, and one part fondant. So the caramel is boiled up to 260 degrees Fahrenheit, not actually to a brown caramel. So you'll see here we have this delicate twill. This is the result um, that it's clear in color. Lovely for presentation and also not very sweet. So how do we do this? Uh, we take the, the three parts, the one part of glucose, fondant, and ice malt, bring it up to 260, and then we pour it out on the siltat. And then once it dries, we break it apart, we shatter it, um, we blend it up in a coffee grinder, and then we take the sieve. So once you have that powdered uh, caramel, we, we take the sieve and sprinkle it over this lovely mold that uh, Chef Bill made for us. And what we end up with after baking that powder is this twill. And what we can do is apply it now to our lovely sphere here, um, which we've just uh, put some honey around the rim, and we can stick it right on. This dessert is a uh, visually stunning dessert, which is a sphere within a sphere. It's based on lemon sorbet, our 1111 uh, cake recipe, angel food cake, almonds, and our uh, caramelized twill. So the first thing we'll do is we'll make our uh, lemon sorbet here in the mixer. And Jason, can I ask you to pour the um, liquid nitrogen? OK, so our, our lemon sorbet mixture is here. And I'll turn it on slowly at first. Okay, you can start to pour. So we kind of have a slurry. It's starting to crystallize slowly. And it's starting to freeze on the side, so that's you're hearing the paddle hit the side. So we have a very nice sorbet, lemon sorbet, here. And we will then get it into a shape that we can use over here. These are um, ice spheres, which we have made very thin. And uh, we'll place that there. And then, um, Tracy, if you could add the angel food cake just to break off some pieces like that, the fruits to go inside and um, inside the sphere, and also along the outside, along with the almonds. And then over here, we have hot uh, sugar water into which we pour this hibiscus. The hibiscus is uh, the calyx of the hibiscus flower and has a lot of antioxidants and becomes a very uh, strong red liquid. We'll let that sit for a moment. OK. And then, Tracy, if you could make our uh, fresh apple juice puree. Beautiful. OK. All right, we're going to uh, have our hibiscus infusion here. So this would be the way it was served at the table side. We would go with our carafe. And 
and uh, go ahead and you can uh, spoon some of that uh, fresh apple juice along the side, outside there. Okay, and while she does that, then we pour our hibiscus infusion into the center. And as it melts the sphere, then it becomes a sauce. On top of that, we add a few almonds and our halva floss. Halva floss is a sesame candy that is a cotton candy made out of halva and a few shards of caramel that will dissolve in our mixture. So we have our sphere within a sphere lemon sorbet. So I think this does a great job of summarizing all of the parts of the course so far, actually, because we have the phase transitions that happen as we um, freeze the sphere. And there is also diffusion happening there as the cold diffuses inwards. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, there's the phase transition and the crystallization that happens in the sorbet. And the, the added energy of the hot infusion, mm -hmm. and then it melts. There's a lot of phase transition mm -hmm. in there. And, and then, of course, the, the brittleness of, of this tweel that is just has this very brittle. Yeah, the 1-1-1-1 one, 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 one tweel. The 1-1-1-1 one, 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 one tweel. Uh -huh. Yeah, great. And, uh, yeah, and foams from the, uh, from the angel food cake itself. True, the, the angel food cake to foam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which is also elastic. Theme of the week. Oh, right, right, yeah. elasticity. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then we have, again, candy and this delicious, it's a different yeah. kind of candy. Yeah, it's the uh, halva, which is a sesame candy that's been turned into a cotton candy by aerating it and by shooting it through um, hot, through small spigots. So that's yeah. sort of similar to our crystallized caramel. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. just a different, different kind. Right. Mm -hmm. Cool.